Okay, so today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about latency and the Scarlett second generation interfaces. So in this instance, we're using a different interface and I've got a number of effects on the vocal channel. I've got two buses, one sending to a delay and one sending to a reverb. And I'm just going to quickly show you what latency is. So I'm going to hit record and Joyce, our singer, is going to sing. Are you made of paper? Okay, so that obviously doesn't cut it. It's not an easy thing to sing with a delayed vocal in your headphones. Uh, so a way to get around it in Logic is to click on the low latency mode button. But what this does is it cancels any of the processing that you have on your channel. So for example here, we don't have any delay, we don't have any reverb or um, anything like that, which is solving one problem of latency, but then creating another problem for Joyce because there's no real-time effects processing and it doesn't sound great in her cans. So it can be detrimental to the performance. So I'm gonna delete this and I'm gonna show you this now and record in her vocal without any processing. Are you made of paper? You stop and you if I hold you up to a naked flame, would you be translucent? Okay, so the latency issue was solved, but there's a distinct lack of effects processing going on. And I think that'll have a knock-on effect to how Joyce is performing, because she can hear it flat and quite lifeless in her headphones. So now I'm going to connect the Scarlett second generation to i2, and I'm going to show you the performance. Okay, so I've connected the Scarlett second generation to i2 um, and I'm gonna switch off low latency mode. So all of my effects processing will be happening in real time with extremely low latency. I'm gonna record on the channel here and I'm gonna record in the vocal so you can hear the difference for yourselves. I am made of paper You stop and you slow if I hold you up to a naked flame, would you be translucent? Have you won the fight, but kept the bruises? We had the best of times back then when we were foolish. So there we go, no latency, effects processing on the vocal in real time, an all round better performance from Joyce because she can hear her own voice. Uh, with delay and reverb on. I don't have to then fiddle with low latency mode, record a vocal, switch it off, listen to the vocal, switch it back on and repeat the process on and on and on. Um, so I really hope that this hits home how powerful the Scarlett second generation interfaces are at improving workflow. Thanks for watching.